So now let's talk about managing a deposit. So you will see at the bottom that I have a healthy deposit. I have about 10 Cody in rewards accumulated already. And I decide I want to add more Cody into this deposit. So I'll go ahead and click Manage. I'll click the amount of Cody I want to add into this particular deposit. Please remember that once you submit a deposit, you cannot go back and change your multiplier, although you can change your locking period. So I will lock this deposit for an additional 30 days. I will check to make sure everything is accurate before I update it. And then I'll go ahead and click update. Please remember that every time you make a deposit, whether you're making a new deposit and or adding to an existing, that there will be a minimal engagement period of 24 hours. So within that 24 hours, you will not be able to withdraw your deposit. Now let's go ahead and look at a deposit that is in liquidation risk. So you can see my deposit here has a multiplier of four and a health factor of 0.71. Any health factor that goes below one will go into liquidation risk and will require to add more funds in order to assure that the deposit won't get liquidated. So let's see what that looks like by clicking add funds. In order to avoid deposit liquidation, you may choose to raise the health factor by depositing additional funds or topping up. The platform currently does not provide an estimated health factor calculation based on the inputted top-up amount. You will be able to see the updated deposit health factor on the Treasury main screen after the top-up transaction is completed. In the future, we will enhance the platform by adding the option to select the targeted health factor and the platform will calculate the estimated top-up amount required to reach the desired health factor. In the meantime, we advise you to use the health factor calculation formula to calculate the top up amount. And then I'll go ahead and click include fees, update, perimeter successfully updated. I'll go back to my screen and it should take a few moments to update it and get it out of liquidation risk. We hope this tutorial helped you understand the amazing new features of the Treasury. We are really excited for the launch of the Treasury and for all of the new users that it will bring. Stay tuned and stay Cody.